All right, uh, greetings family. We're live on Revolutionary Camp. This is Bomani Taemba. I'm here in Ghana, West Africa. It is Friday, May 26th, and we're at Kwame Nkrumah Memorial Park and family. This is my 12th time in Ghana and my 12th time at this park here. I can never get enough of the great Kwame Nkrumah. We love the fact that he did a whole lot for our African family globally and the fact that he was always looking to incorporate us as Africans on the continent and Africans on the diaspora connecting together. The fact that he was not all about Ghana's independence and the fact that he was about the independence of the entire African continent and African diaspora and then the fact that the black star Marcus Garvey connection, I love it. I mean, you know, the fact that he you know, he looked at one of the, our greatest Pan-Africanists and incorporated some of the colors of, you know, the flag, the black star, uh, you know, the, in name of the team, the shipping line, and many different things that you're gonna find the energy of Marcus Garvey in Ghana. And, you know, and Kwame Nkrumah, that connection is incredible. In our tour book, you know, we give a nice profile of Marcus Garvey and Kwame Nkrumah and show the, the link and the connection. I'm born in Kingston, Jamaica and I'm here in Ghana, lived in America. So all of this is relevant to all of us who are in the world of Pan-Africanism. You see our company, is called, our company is called Africa for the Africans for a reason. And this is the work of our ancestors, the connection of our two great leaders and visionaries that have thus uh, shared with you. And people like myself learning from their works and their energy and being, a, and just really just being happy to be a part of this movement of energy, you know what I mean? But, you know, family, the things that we do is not a job. This is more than just a business. This is a lifetime mission to keep our people connected on the African continent, to keep our people linking and realizing that repatriation and investing in Africa is the most important thing. You know? and, and for, for a lot of you folks there on the plantation, come with us to Africa and spend some money and enjoy the journey of a lifetime. And our goal is to connect you with many wonderful things. You know, you go, we go way beyond tourism. I mean, we go into nation building. You know? Our program is fully based on the vision of our ancestors. You know? We talk about Malcolm X. We talk about uh, you know, Kwame Nkrumah. We're talking about uh, Marcus Garvey. We're talking about you know, three of our best visionaries and incorporating their works into what we now have as Africa for Africans. 2006, that's when we were established. Fully been in business well over 10 strong years, 12 wonderful journeys to the African continent, in, to the country Ghana, and we have many wonderful countries that we go to, including Togo, Benin, Ethiopia, we have Tanzania on the list, uh, Cote d'Ivoire, South Africa, and more countries to come. My family, our goal is to expand and create more repatriation opportunities for our folks in the African diaspora, because we need to return to the home of our ancestors. We need to get away from that slave life on the plantation in America. Yes, family, for some of you who have all these big time jobs in America, making all this money, you're just a slave on the plantation as a black man and a black woman. America does not care about you. America just wanna use your labor. Come to Africa, be a part of the future. And Kuma and Ali Selassie reached out to us in the 50s and the 60s and said African people in diaspora, come home. So family, you know, you, you know what I mean? I'm fully ready for this and I'm asking all my brothers and sisters that's down with repatriation, please reach out to us so we can make this movement stronger. And for those haters that just want to talk, mess, you know, just go, just go bury yourself somewhere or go back in the alley. You know, this is about hard work and nation building, straight revolutionary. We don't have time for people gossiping and, and, and all this other stupid stuff that people are doing trying to trying to destroy this movement. We're looking to take this to the next level, family. All right, real black power, real African black power. Keep it strong, family.